Hello there. Good morning. Good morning. We are on our way to where? To Devon. So we're on a little holiday. We're stopping off at um, Gloucester Services on the way. So hopefully we get to film that a little bit. If we just drop the cat off at the cattery, haven't we? And we yeah, always feel so for, for a little bit sad. It's because of that. We had to like, and John locked me in the cat in the cattery like the um, <laughs> pen by accident. Kind of holiday on my own. <laughs> just quite funny. Um, so yeah, we, we really wanted a holiday, even though we're going on a cruise not far away in the future. I really wanted one, and you yeah. did as well. It's like a little mini break to Devon, isn't it? Yeah. And we never stayed over in Sidmouth before, have we? No. So it'd be a nice little like adventure for us. Yeah, so we'll show you around what we can. Yeah, so see you in a little while. What do you want from the one sausage roll? So it's £18.40 for two puppies and two sausage rolls. <laughs> Paid by card, yeah? Yeah. Is that what you want, yeah? Yeah. Do you want chips? No. We're just really excited to get, get, get to Sidmouth and take you along with us. Hopefully we'll get to show you the seaside and some of the other main places and the hotel that we're going to. Um, and it has an outdoor swimming pool, which is perfect in, what is the temperature now? 26. 26 degrees. I'm going to have to put on my Factor 50, so I don't go like a lobster, but other, yeah, but it's going to be beautiful, like cooling, hopefully. Um, is it an adults only hotel? No. So we're getting closer to Sidmouth. The roads are getting a bit narrower, but this is still an A road, but it's like, closer to get narrower, much more countryside views. We've already seen like loads of farm shops. Greg. Still Greg, so <laughs> keeping it local. 26 degrees. 26 degrees. The sun was coming on my legs too much. I'm hoping I've just got prickly heat, but I feel like the sun has burnt my legs through the window. John's like rolling his eyes, but we feel like we can st we start to sense the sea over this hill. We're hoping that we're gonna get the view, first view of the sea. Let's have a look. It's starting to feel a bit like seaside you now. But it still says we've got 15 minutes. It's gone to orange now because I think, because of the sea, as you get closer to the seaside, it gets busier, doesn't it? Mm. I think it's like loads of fern, you know, like in like the Yorkshire Dales and stuff, and peat districts. Furs? Ferns, you know, like um, Oh peat yeah, districts. like ferns and that. Oh yeah, it's oh. just rolling hills. Rolling hills, yeah, not the seaside yet. John just said it's gone to orange now. The time's not really going down. We keep driving closer, but it still says 14 minutes. I'm saying the view is pretty cool. Like it's not sea yet, but it's like hills and the roads are getting definitely windier and hillier. Sometimes I think, like, uh, people with caravans let me know, but I sometimes think, how do the caravans get up these, like, roads, like, a really steep and single track? I mean, great difficulty, but I wouldn't really fancy it. Some Devon cottages, look. They're quite pretty, aren't they? On a busy road, though, again. But they are pretty. Thatch cottages. Not really suitable for us, though, because we're both quite tall gentlemen, aren't we? Yeah, that's a double all the time. Yeah, hit our heads on beams. It's now gone to red 11 minutes. Oh, coffee shop cream teas, John. Mm. You wanted a cream tea, didn't you? I'm hoping to have one on this holiday. Well, couldn't eat one today, though, could you? No, not after that, okay. Tidmouth Regency Town by the Sea. In the moment, it's going to be our first glimpse of the sea. So you can join us when we see it for the first time. We haven't seen it yet. I think I see the sea. Yay! Look at it, John. I've seen the sea for ages. I've waited since last year when we were in Greece. And if you want to watch that video when we're on the cruise, it's in our library, whatever it's called. Look how lucky we were to get parked right outside. Good, John. Look at the view. Oh, wow. So we arrived at the hotel. We'll do like a proper room tour after, but we want to go and see Sidmouth now, so come with us. Yay! And they're playing cricket over there. How was it really pretty here?
on the way to Carnot Gardens. It yeah. is so boiling. It's so hot. They're really nice. It's beautiful. It's really hot. So we've arrived now at Connaught Gardens. Paul's just on the step. Flag award winner. Mm. Spaces. So we just walked for a few minutes from the hotel. Nice and cool by the trees. Connaught Gardens around Britain and Bloom. Blooming lots of times. Look at that. See if it's worth it. Look at that. What do you think, John? It's really nice. Look at the view as well. It's all the cliffs as well. I can't wait to get around this case. corner. That is blooming beautiful. Look at that. I do love a red bush. There's loads of places to sit in this park. Like here, if you're really adverse to sunlight, there's like a really shady one inside the, like an alcove there. And those toilets. That's useful. Going down this nice walkway, which is really cool to find a little chair or bench to sit on. Because it's so wooded, it's um, quite a few degrees cooler, and it's really nice to be in the. Because the heat got to me a bit, if you can tell from my slurred speech. So we've been sitting here for probably like 10 to 20 minutes, just have a nice like break yeah. in the cool. It's really chill here. Yeah. So we're going to have a look around the gardens and then we're going to hopefully um, go down the big steps all the way down to the beach and see if there's a little ice cream shop or something. Yeah. I do feel very dehydrated but I'm trying to drink loads of water. The greenhouse here that John's just filming has got lots of cacti in. I'm not even going to go in it because it's like 26 degrees out here so inside there it must be like, I don't know, like unbelievably hot. He's going to go inside and dehydrate further. Is it hot in there John? It's hot yeah, it's actually not too bad. But... I'm show you all the cactus. Just doing, it, doing this all for you. I wonder if I can lock the door. The door's locking now John. The door's shutting. The quick. <laughs> John filming the roses. This is Sidmouth Beach. March with the sea view for it. John's gonna go through and have a look. Wow. Just wow. Oh my god, look at that. What do you think? Really nice, yeah. Loads of places to sit as well. Which beach is this then? I think that's the, um, that's the walk one. Yeah, that's the walk I said a minute ago. Oh yeah. Ladder. Look it's at that. Jacob's ladder. Look at that staircase. Is that called Jacob's Ladder that? Yeah. Mmm, that's scary. So there's a cafe in the garden called the Clock Tower just to the edge. Just before you go to Jacob's Ladder. I bet those beach huts are worth a penny, beautiful ones, all like pastel shades or ice creamy colours. Mm. It's quite solid. Yeah, not Oh, we're sort of like a third of the way. I don't want to come back up. <laughs> well, we will be, won't we? No, we're going to walk along. Oh, okay. Well, oh, that's past there. To the car park. No. Oh, it's along the beach. <laughs> have to get an ice cream, won't we, now? Yeah, yeah we made it. So, I got a chocolate. Cone with a chocolate whippy. Mm. I think this was Rusty Lee that did this, you know, that famous cook off TV in the 80s, like the lady. She came <laughs> here like and did that. And signed it, yeah. Rusty Lee. Danger falling rocks. Better to get moving then. That looks a bit dodgy, you know, that cage thing up there to stop the rocks. Oh, yeah. Right? So we're just walking on a little coastal path from where we bought our ice cream. 
which is about 9.80 for two 99 yeah. cones they only had chocolate with people it was really nice yeah and then we're going to walk into Sidmouth now you can see some rocks just there we're discussing whether they are called shit rocks or chit rocks they're spelled c-h-i-t but if you know let us know but i think it's chit john thinks it's shit paul's just getting a free refill on the beach that's where we're heading later for dinner some really pretty houses here there's also lots of um, four-star hotels. These are Regency, aren't they, I think? Yeah. We're just headed into town now to have a little look at the shops. So we just stopped for ice latte. Decaf. It's really nice and cool in air conditioning. Yeah, we needed it. We needed like some sort of fresh air because it's like scorchio. But it's lovely, it's really lovely. But like when you're walking around in it, you need to be up in the sea, like the clever people, like swimming around in the cold water. We're gonna go in the pool in a little while. It's just gorgeous here, isn't it? Yeah, it's really nice. It's our hotel, and if you look at the furthest right, there's like a corner tower. We're on the first floor, and we're in the first one, which is a balcony going from right to left. I've sweated so much, but the sweat's now going in my eyes with the suntan lotion. Is that like the worst thing ever, do you think? Yeah, I hate when it's that horrible. happens. It's really painful. <laughs> John's talking yeah. to his mum and dad. Now yeah. we've had a really nice time at the pool. It was really nice. Yeah, yeah we were relaxing. Now we're going to go back to the room and get changed. Yes. Ready to go out for dinner. A few moments later. We're just about to go out to the restaurant and um, I thought I'd take you through my outfit of the day. I'm wearing a multi-pack t-shirt from Next with some linen shorts and some brown Timberland trainers. I think mine is a Jack and my multi-pack t-shirt. Oh yeah. And then followed by um, some Sainsbury shorts. Oh nice. Two two ones. Yeah, and then some June shoes that I worn before. Oh yeah. <laughs> I think we're just keeping it really simple and really real. Casual. Yeah, really casual. Quite a posh old car though, isn't it? Yeah, so it rocks. Mm. Yeah, the breeze is really nice and cool, isn't it? Yeah. I am. Look at the, the sea, flowers. the flowers and the sea. It's so pretty, isn't it? Really good for a wedding menu, yeah. yeah. Well, we'll take you down a little alley now to the main thoroughfare. You can bagel shop there. So these are the crab croquettes. So this is the pork belly with broccoli. So we got chunky chips. I think you can tell we liked it. The sunset is just over the headland. We just had a lovely meal. And it was actually, really good, one of the nicest meals I've had for a while. Yeah, really, really good. Really, good. really enjoyed it. Look at that. Mm. Isn't it looking beautiful? John's taking a shit on the beach. John, you can't do a shit on the beach. <laughs> I was just taking the photo of the sea, I think. What are you doing, Artie? You're doing an Artie shot, are you? Is this for like, is this for like bedtime so you can listen to the sound of the sea at bedtime yeah. to get to sleep? Yeah. yeah. It's actually quite a workout walking on the beach. <laughs> Dog's having the time of its life out on the beach. Look at so Look, it's loving it, isn't it? <laughs> Look. We thought the folk festival started tomorrow when we left, but it's already started. I think yeah. they're rehearsing. Yeah, really. people are in town so early. Yeah, but behind us, like, like, yeah, it's like a big tent and stuff. Yeah. So Paul was saying it's a ticketed event. However, yeah. you can just chill out out here, can't you? Yeah, and listen to it out here. Yeah, some there's like cafes pool. and like a, get some beer. So there's a swimming pool in there. Oh yeah. Look at all the seagulls. What are the grey ones? The baby ones. No. This is the River Sid. There is a coastal walkway along there, and the river Sid goes is into it, the sea. Is it named after like Sid out of like 
carry on films? No, things do <laughs> Sidmouth. Okay. That's where we were earlier in the vlog. So at Chips Rock. Chips Rock. The sun is finally setting. It is. It's beautiful, doesn't it? Really nice, yeah. Yeah, beautiful. It's quite a nice area down here at night where you can have a drink or some food. So we're not having a coffee, we're having a hot chocolate. And we're just keeping it local. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, now we're heading to the bedroom to go on our balcony. A little sneak at the pool before we go in tomorrow morning. Looks quite enticing. So we've just had a flapjack that we got yesterday from Flapjackery for breakfast. Um, we're having that because we're going to go to the spa in a little bit. As you can see, Paul's frantically signed to pack. <laughs> Can't find it. It's too messy. <laughs> too hot in the room so we've got back from the spa and now we're going to go out to a new place um, called Seaton which is a nearby seaside town. Yay! Yay. Outside the hotel there's some better to pray. Standing guard. We've been guarding our car while we've been staying here. Yeah. <laughs> Do they get hot in the sun? I don't know. It's very quiet in the morning isn't it? Yeah. Bye. Bye. Um, we think we're going through the National Trust area at the moment. It's dark, but on the camera it's coming out quite light. It's picking out quite a lot of colour. It's oh, pretty right. good. Through the forest. Apologies if it doesn't come out. The cameras are pretty bad in the dark. And also they get too hot as well. But it looks really bright. Mm. Like the doesn't look like it does outside the window. Yeah, it's really dark. Is it because of our sunglasses though? Oh, maybe. Might be. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or we the cleverest. <laughs> clever, clever. That was nice to trust there because it had the signs up. Yeah. I wonder if that was a cafe. I think it's free. They didn't say it had a cafe. Facilities were parking, so. I know um, JFR, oh. um, Jack knows that we love a cafe. Yeah. Especially with involves cake, cake and coke. Well. Yeah, cake and coffee. Yeah. I'm saying the same to John for the novelty value this is alright, but I wouldn't couldn't live somewhere like this. We just went through like a single lane bit and there was like people walking along with dogs and stuff and it was very and close. The was really high. Yeah, and the it was all like hard on each side, like walls and things. And there was a house there and I was like, I wouldn't like to live there. I quite actually like where we live, which is like um next to an easy to use dual carriageway. <laughs> 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 but that's just I mean, I know it's a beautiful countryside but this would just you do, do like your dual carriageway I do like it because you come out you're just straight on it you can go anywhere like really quickly <laughs> can't you yeah. whereas here like it's it's well, alright for like a holiday where you're just ambling along but can you imagine if you had to get somewhere for work or something and you've got these yeah, like it's just windy and um some people enjoy this sort of driving. I enjoy it on a holiday and I like being a passenger, but... Mm. I think I some of the cars are too big to go. Yeah, on. like I don't really think, I know they have it because of like, but look at this, like, look how tight that is for that car, because it's such a big car. Like they're stuck now, they think. And it all gets a bit silly now. fun just to watch yeah. see if they actually make it through going down towards the seaside now see the sea on the horizon it's 
mad because when you film it, it looks like only a little bit of blue, but when you look at your eyes, your eyes sort of zoom in to like the Z, so it makes, mm. it makes it look a lot bigger, doesn't it? It's like that with the moon, I think. So, I just arrived in Seaton. We're gonna go and grab some breakfast. Yes. Yes. Before we decided to stay in Sidmouth, we actually were gonna stay here in the Premier Inn. Yes. So, it's interesting to see it still. It looks exactly the same in some ways to Sidmouth with the hotels that are up on the up on the hill over there, like our hotel. But it looks like they've been made into apartments. Might be because perhaps it's very similar looking though, isn't it? Yeah, that side. Yeah, like a mixture as like the red rock and then the white rock. So we are now going to take you on the tramway with us. Yay! Yeah, we're just heading towards that at the moment. So we arrived at Seaton Tramway, we're going to do a touristy thing and go on the tram for a little scenic route. That's a smaller one isn't it? But yeah, we can get off here if you have a Roma. We don't have a Roma ticket, we have like this station one to the end. So this is the first stop. I guess it's going to be quite savy on the way back. Wetlands, lots of bird life, black hole marsh, a lot of hides, a lot of bird twitches in the hides, twitching the birds. So I just arrived at Colleton Station and Paul's gone to get a cream tea from the buffet. So Paul's got a, the cream tea here for one. <laughs> for both of them. For one, yeah, but it's for me as well. We're going to share it, aren't we? Do we do it? Yeah, you can do it. You can be done. Way back now. To nine and we're having carrot cake. The only other thing we got, we had a little bit of a spend in the shop, but because we uh, saw loads of reduced things, so we got half price off beet, beef with beetroot horseradish. Well, they were little pies, weren't they? Yeah, little pies. Vegan, right. vegan pub grub scotchy. It's two of those. And then Gloucester Old Spot was a pie as well. Yeah. So we're doing really well. I'll cook them in the air fryer, that'll help. I lost a pound, <laughs> a pound and a half last week. I'm probably going to put three pounds on this. <laughs> week. Thank you for watching our video to the end. You can see we've got like the beige stuff ready to have. 
I'm got... not sure about this. This is a scotch egg. The vegan one. It's vegan, but I didn't think about that when we bought it. But the egg inside looks very suspect because <laughs> it's not an egg, is it? Because it's vegan. What's Interesting, it? yeah. What is it made out of, John? I haven't got a clue. Um, Usually but... eggy things are made out of like chickpea, aren't they, or something? Yeah. Go there. So we're about to have those. We've got one each of each plate mm. and we've halved it all which is nice and um, we've got a few videos hopefully coming up soon so we've got the cruise coming up on the channel um we might hopefully go on a day trip to london hopefully for somewhere i want to visit which i think you know about i'm not going to say where but mm. in london and then also um maybe in january somewhere also interesting yeah so it's all very suspicious. We don't know for sure yet. Yeah, it's um, in the pipeline. Isn't yeah, it? so join us next time. Yeah, if you liked the videos, please do a thumbs up to like them and subscribe and hit the no notification bell so you know when the next ones are coming out. Why okay. we need the beige stuff? We're going to watch, because we've been away, we're behind on our vlogs that we watch, and we're going to be watching JFR's Coral Sea Sen Sensatory Resort full room tour which we uh, will look forward to and enjoy while we eat in our beige yeah so, so if you haven't seen his videos check them out they're really cool get yeah. in the holiday mood he's such a positive person you'll love his videos as well you've been giving us yet <laughs> see what it's like <laughs> that was a vegan no. one <laughs> no <laughs> no that's wrong that's disgusting <laughs>